Hello, I am Big Mike and welcome to another episode of Big Mike Muniz Toyota T27 Garage. Um, today we're going to talk about brake fluid, something that most people don't talk about or even bother checking. But did you know that your brake fluid needs to be replaced around two to three years? Um, you can't always go by time either or mileage or the color of the brake fluid. Most people think that if the brake fluid is dark, it needs to be replaced. But that's not always true. Um, so what I'm going to show you is the easiest way to test your brake fluid. I'm sure everybody has a, uh, a multimeter at home, a DVOM. So we're going to use a DVOM galvanic reaction test. So what is this about? Well, the majority of today's braking system use a combination of dissimilar metals. Manufacturers use aluminum in pistons and housings and steel in brake lines and some wheel cylinders. When moisture mixes with the brake fluid, a galvanic reaction or corrosion can occur. Um, the higher the moisture content in the brake fluid, the higher the galvanic reaction, and the greater the um, erosion, corrosion it causes in the brake system. Um, the DVOM galvanic reaction test measures the voltage created by the galvanic reaction due to the level of moisture in the fluid. So how are we gonna do that? So first we're going to turn this on, DC, DC voltage, we're going to zero out your DVOM, we're going to open up your first reservoir, you're going to find a ground, and you're going to stick the positive side in the fluid. You should have less than 0.3 volts registering if that's below 0.3 volts then you're good if you're above 0.3 volts then you need to replace your brake fluid right now I'm showing 0.237 pretty close to 0.3 volts so this is getting pretty close to be needing a, uh, a flush so I hope you're able to test your vehicle and see if you need to have your brake fluid flush um, very important. So thank you for watching. I'm gonna go and test the other two reservoirs and see if I need to flush out the whole entire system, clutch and brakes.